Wester here, going to do a binding of an AR7700 Spectrum receiver to a DX7S. Okay, so what you do is you power everything off, plug in your bind port into the bind port location on the end there. I've got my PPM connector plugged into my DS, uh, my, um, got my Bavarian um, 3SX um, into the PPM port, which is on these things, it is um, when you're looking at the back with your now uh, the flashing light to the front right hand corner, it's the second one from the left. So the one on the very left is the one that, we, that you plug in your programming cable from your computer. Okay, so we've got the bind plug in. We want to switch it into bind mode. Normally you've got to bind the bind buttons here. I've just switched them around and rewired it so for my own personal reasons. But anyway, that's in bind mode now. And it's going to be expecting that to come on. So we're just going to put my power my um, server my system up. Make sure you've got your wires disconnected on your motor. I've only got one connected so it can't do anything. Okay, it's in bind receive mode. You can see these flashing hard out there on the good old receiver. And the satellite is doing the same. Okay, so now we just need to turn this on. And I want to put it into the mode that basically wherever you leave this, it will um, basically build in its fail safe so if it loses range signal it will actually default to whatever setup you bind it at. So we're going to leave everything central and neutral and I'm going to leave it at neutral pitch as well so that it's going to be just to be descending at a slow, reasonably slow rate and it should stabilise at um, central position. So I'm just going to turn that on to bind it. And put it back into the normal position. It's binding. Okay, that's restarted. We've got a solid light now on the AR7700 and a solid light on the satellite. Now we, while it's powered up, we disconnect the connection for the bind cable. So pull that out. And that's bound.